Okay, we've just had our Tesco delivery this week and it's nine o'clock at night, <laughs> but that's the only space they had. Um, but we've got a massive shop because we've got to do lunch boxes again because we're back to school tomorrow. And we've also got a load of stuff over here because it's Sienna's birthday at the weekend. So we've got lots of party food and things that she wanted for her birthday. Um, so yeah, it is a massive shop. So I will just get cracking. So we've got some juice, some orange juice and apple juice and skimmed milk. Then we've got all of our almond milks that we get. Um, we've got some almond croissants that we'll put in the freezer. We might have these for Sienna's birthday breakfast or just at the weekend at some point. Some garlic breads just to pop in the freezer. Then we've got some mints. We bought this because you can cook it from frozen um, just to see if it's any like quicker and easier um, for like after school meals. And the girls love burrito bowls at the moment, so we'll use that for burrito bowls. We've got some honey roast ham for lunch boxes, sandwiches, ham and cheese, roll ups, that kind of thing. Some sweet potato fries and some Chinese pork loin. So that will be like a meal with some broccoli or carrots, quick and easy. We have got some bacon medallions, 10 smoked bacon medallions, again for breakfast or lunches with eggs. Roma loves bacon and eggs, so that will come in handy at some point. We have got some 50-50 bread, two lots of crisps, so we've got Cheetos and we've got Disco's, just trying to switch it up a bit with the flavours and stuff. Some pop chips, we've got two lots of barbecue pop chips. We've got some creme fraiche for our burrito bowls that we're gonna make. Two lots of baby potatoes with butter, again, just for a quick and easy meal after school. And the girls really like them. I'm still struggling with fussy eaters, so I'm just trying to <laughs> switch it up and see what kind of things they like. Got a lot of pantry staples. Um, we donated some on our trick or treat. They had bins out um, donating for the food bin. So you kind of get your, tr your treat and your sweets, but you're also giving as well, which I thought was a really good idea. Um, so we took some stuff out of our pantry. So we had to like restock. So we've got sweet corn, red kidney beans and chopped tomatoes. Then we've just got some tinned fruit for when the fresh fruit runs out some hot dogs, some guacamole topping, some barbecue sauce and ketchup because we had run out. Over here we've got some sour cream as well. Um, I think I missed a load, I don't know where to go this week, it's all a bit of a random mix. We've got some candy floss grapes, two lots of those and some blueberries. We've got some baby plum tomatoes, um, a couple of Chinese ready meals. Again, that's just quick and easy for me and Warren at the weekend. Um, two massive broccolis, a bag of carrots and a bag of peppers. Got two lots of these protein bars for me and Warren again as well. Um, baby jam lettuce again for lunches or maybe with the burrito bowls we've got some cereal we've got quite a lot in the pantry but we've got strawberry crisp honey nut clusters and some shreddies we have got a pack of rice again for burrito bowls then we've got three pepperoni pizzas just to keep in the freezer we might use them for sienna's um party just cut them up or we might use them for a meal i'm not sure yet um, some chips, we ordered french fries but they subbed them for the straight cut chips but that's fine. Oh we've got three cucumbers hiding under here. We've got some apples, some satsumas and some strawberries. Um, crackers, they love crackers with butter at the moment as a snack um, after school or they take them with a bit of cheese for their mid-morning snack at school as well so that's good. We've got some free range eggs, um, pack, five packs of these coated raisins, again for snack or in their lunchbox. 
and then we've also got these apple and strawberry fruit smoothie snacks again it's just handy to have as a snack um to chuck in their bags when we're running late or whatever or when we've run out of fresh fruit they're a really good staple to have in the pantry we've also got some yo-yo bears they seem to be addicted to these at the moment um they literally are having them like every single day so we've got some of those we've got two bags of mini pepper armies again for lunch boxes and the fridge raiders they all like these so we've got nine mini packs for lunch boxes we've got some savory eggs we've got a lot of these protein yogurts for warren we've got some soda water with lime we've got some tortilla chips to have with the burrito bowls then we have got a selection for Sienna's party. So we've got pink lemonade, um, orange and lemon and lime, I think. We've got some toilet roll. I feel like I've missed something here. I don't think I have. Um, so that's like our main shop. We've got quite a lot of chicken in the freezer. Um, so yeah, that should do us some meals. I'll show you the meal plan at the end. But then over here, we've got the stuff for Sienna's party. Um, so we've got some cheese balls, salt and vinegar sticks. Then we've got various candies that we can do like pick a mix, some mod teasers and some party rings. Um, and I think a lot of this was on offer. So we might not use all of this because it's quite a lot, especially after Halloween. But we can always keep it for Christmas. That's a good thing about a November birthday. Um, she also requested watermelon for breakfast. Then we've got some little nibbly bits. We've got pork cocktail sausages, chicken poppers, chicken satays. Um, we've got some pineapple chunks. We're going to do cheese and pineapple as well. Then this is her cake. So I got this one. So she, you know I normally make the cakes, but she's got pretty high hopes for a disco ball cake this year. And I just wasn't sure I could pull it off. So I have bought a cake, but I am going to decorate the top myself um, and hope that it looks good because the last time I tried to make one, it didn't look that great. But yeah, this is the cookies and cream cake. It serves 18 and I thought as well, it says it's suitable for freezing, which is quite good if you wanted to buy it in advance. Um, but it's got like the different layers i don't know if you can see there the cookies and cream layers so when you cut it open it will look quite impressive but i will tell people i haven't made it <laughs> um but yeah she really wanted the drips around the side as well and some disco balls on the top and i just wish wasn't sure it was gonna look good so <laughs> we've got that and then we got some of the frozen party food. Again, this was on offer from Tesco. I think it was three for five pounds. So we've just stocked up. We may not use it all for Sienna's birthday, but we can keep it in the freezer and use it for Christmas or Boxing Day, Christmas Eve, that kind of thing, because we normally have this kind of food then as well. So we've got pepperoni pizza parcels, three lots of Tempura King prawns, some brie bites, some mini prawn toast, some pigs in blankets, some mini filled churros and some corn dogs. And then over here we've just got three lots of pork sausage rolls, um, the Higgity brand. I don't know if I can freeze these or not, I think you can. Yeah, you can. Yeah, so you can freeze those as well if we don't need all of those so that is like the party stuff as well so that is our big shop i'll just show you the meal plan now so this is our meal plan so uh we've got chinese pork the new potatoes and the broccoli and then as i said i've got a lot of chicken breast in the freezer so i'm gonna make my own hunter's chicken because we've got a lot of cheese as well um we can have that with rice and carrots um, then Wednesday, possibly the hot dogs and the sweet potato fries. Thursday, we'll have the burrito bowls. Um, we've got avocados already and things like that. So that would be quite a nice meal that they'll eat with lots of veggies in. Friday, we might have the Chinese 
ready meals, girls might have pasta, something quick like that because Sienna has a after school club on Fridays and it's quite tight for time. Then on Saturday we'll have the party food and then Sunday we'll make toad in the hole with cauliflower cheese. So that is our massive food shop. <laughs> I hope you enjoyed this. I hope it gave you some good ideas of meals. I'm really struggling again still. So as always, leave your meal plan in the comments below so I can get some more inspiration. And I will see you next time. Bye.